I don't know. I don't know, guys. Uh, I think this is a clear indication that when it comes to Africa, Nigerian music and entertainment industry, we do not really care about the women. We are biased. We indeed discriminate the women. Like I said yesterday, the Grammy is not all about two artists. The Grammy is not all about the men. Asake, Davido, Bonaboy. The Grammy is not all about them. We have women also. The same category. The one from South Africa and our own Arya Star. It's not all about these theory boys. Asake, Davido, and Bonaboy. So, I can easily say the African music entertainment industry is really, really biased and discriminated against women. And of course, I think even the US also, because currently we only see our boys partying, get invited to all those exclusive events, performing and everything. But our female uh, entertainers who are, who are also nominated for the same category are not being invited, are not performing, are not enjoying the same privileges that these guys are enjoying. Let us, for once, think about it. Grammy is not all about them, guys. It's not all about them. Let's be honest. It's not all about them. And that being said, the seats are already out. I remember we had an argument a few weeks ago. Someone said David Doe won't be invited for the main event. Like, David Doe won't get a seat. A seat right inside the Grammy stage. Maybe David Doe will be at the back. But fortunately for you guys all, eh? Gone are all those days. Our Africa artists are big artists. We perform. We shut down our arenas. So how, how can someone easily just come up with such callous talk and say David Doe will not get a seat among the stars? Well, guess what? The seats are already out. David Doe is sitting close to Omega the Stallion. Very, very close to uh, celebrities, even just close to Jay-Z by the side there. And meanwhile, Bonaboy is sitting close to 21 Savage, Brandy by the other side, and Taylor Swift at the other side. So, we are at the main stage. We are at the main stage, not back anymore. We are right in center. We are sitting with the stars. Huh? But it's the discrimination that I do not like. Let me be honest with you. We are talking about David. Where is Asake City? Where is Asake City? I have not seen Asake. This media, international media, are only just focusing on uh, David Doe and Bonaboy. The David Doe, Bonaboy, David Doe, Bonaboy, David Doe, Bonaboy. Where is the Arresta seat? Where is the South Africa lady seat? Tyler seat. Where is uh, Asake seat? In fact, recently, according to uh, data from X, they said music fans are lighting up X with chatter ahead of the Grammys. Conversation about this year award has already received over 44, 446 million total impression, with 64% more posts and 129 more vi videos view compared to last year. The most talked about artists across the country so far are number one, Beyonce, number two, Billie Eilish, number, Tilly, uh, number three, Olivia, number four, Taylor Swift, number five, Dua Lipa, and number six, our very own border boy. I never said with Nicki Minaj. Why is Nicki Minaj uh, name popping up? Nicki Minaj wasn't uh, nominated, right? And Nicki Minaj, Nicki Minaj had never won the Grammy. That is one crazy stuff. That is one crazy stuff. And there was one crazy comparison that came recently. Really, really crazy comparison that came recently. <laughs> Honestly, crazy one. Someone said because of uh, okay, you know what I'm. I am going to go there, but let us firstly uh, talk about this Nicki Minaj. Nicki Minaj never been nominated for a Grammy. And, well, 
she has she, she has been never she has been nominated severally but she never won a grammy so many other credible rich entertainers with massive fans millions of followers massive fan still really really uh still really really still popping out music as at this time so like Nicki Minaj, just imagine no one grammy award then number eight is SZA, that's the girl with the highest Grammy nomination. I think she has about nine Grammy nominations. And number nine, Cardi B, and number 10, Travis Scott. But well, I'm just focusing on our own very own artist, Border Boy. I think when you come to Africa entertainment, yeah, if you come to when you come to uh, about when you come down to Africa entertainment in Nigeria, the most talk about person about this Grammy is Davido first and Bonner Boy second. Then as I get third, I rasta fourth. No, it's uh, Davido first, uh, Bonner Boy second, and Whiskey. Well, I'm able to put Whiskey first because everybody's buzzing about that guy. The guy is not able to talk about, but people are just mockery, making mockery of him, why his fans are just quiet, his fans are bringing out old, who do the, 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 the videos of the Grammy he, and he won alongside Beyonce, but the Grammy never really recognized Whiskey for winning, for winning an award, though, because the Grammy released a list of African artists that have won an award. It's not new. The Grammy themselves released a list of African artists that have won an award, and Whiskey's name is not there. And the reason why Whiskey's name is not there is because she, he didn't, it's not his original work. He was featured on that work, so it's not in his Beyonce that has an award. And meanwhile, Thames also, Thames name wasn't even there, and Thames wasn't even nominated for any award this year again. You know, it's just crazy. That's just how it is. Well, I just hope this artist, you know, Grammy Award is a big deal, whether you like it or not. Some people will say, oh, it's not a big deal. It's a big deal. It's a big deal when it comes to the entertainment industry. It's the highest award for musicians. Just like how the Oscar is the highest award for, for, for actors. You no, know, Grammy is the highest award for musicians. So that just it, guys. So whether you guys like it or not, you guys say it's not important, it's very, very important. And despite so many entertainers will come up and say, oh, all I want, all I'm, uh, all I care about is just the music and my fans and everything. Kudos to them, but deep down in their heart, they want to win at least one Grammy award. Let's be honest, they want to win it at least one Grammy award, at least just one. Yeah. So I hope all those artists who are deserving of it get the opportunity to win at least just one award. Honestly, I hope and. Today is the award day, 8 p.m. Uh, USA time. That is uh, uh, Los Angeles will be the venue at one particular arena. And then, this is guys, when, it, when it's 8, uh, 8 p.m. over there, we are six hours ahead. So by 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2 o'clock, early in the morning, uh, 2 a.m. in the morning, Nigeria time, that's where you will be able to watch it. So I will be awake till that time, and most definitely I'm going to watch it and capture every scenario about the Grammys. I'm not going to miss it for anything this time. Come on, man. I'm not going to miss it. I will sleep earlier today. I'm going to rest well. I'm not going to exhaust uh, uh, exhaust myself so that I will be able to gather strength to be able to watch it and still stay fresh till morning. So just stay tuned, guys. I will be giving you everything. And whether we like it or not, somebody must take home an award. Someone must win that award. Be it the girl from South Africa, uh, Arya Star, Asake, Bonner Boy, or, or uh, David Dwan. Olamide is also there as well. Olamide uh, flew to LA uh, yesterday, was himself and... Uh, to Fesidibia saw not only Bonaboy and uh, uh, not only Bonaboy and David will be on that uh, in that uh, venue. 
not only them. We have Asake there, Arasta there, and so many of our artists that are not even nominated. We also to be there because they are invited. So not just only them. So we are hoping, man. Things will go smoothly. I can't wait. Honestly, I can't wait. Honestly. Honestly, I can't wait, guys. I honestly cannot wait. Hmm? So, guys, like I've said before, I think the uh, the media are very, very biased, not uh, taking our women along. You know, only, we do not only have all those uh, men who, are, who can perform party now. Let them invite others as well. But usually, the men are not for partying, so the women just kind of like chill and uh, relax. Chill and relax. The men are known for going from one venue to another and everything. And again, going back to what I wanted to say. Because of uh, this picture of uh, uh, dear Chris Brown, David Doe, and Asake hanging out together, someone did a comparison and the person said, Bonner Boy is bigger than the three of them put together. You see your crazy C finish. Hmm? Let me make this clear. Hmm? Chris Brown, eh? Hmm? When you combine Bonner Boy sales, Asake sales, David Doe sales, musically, everything. Eh? The number see reach half of Chris Brown. That's on, that just what I'm saying. The one see reach half of what Chris Brown catalog they talk. This is a guy almost 20 years in the game. Almost 20 years in the game. He was even awarded like every he said he's the only artist in the century that has charted every year on what uh billboard uh, 100 every year. For the past 20 years, Chris Brown has chatted on Billboard Hot 100. Holy Chris Brown. And I've got multiple sales. See, I have great respect because you see Chris Brown hanging out, being free, and not about that big artist made the carry shoulder. That doesn't mean you disrespect him like that. Eh? That doesn't mean you disrespect him like that. Be careful, man. 